trampoline that will be team event gymnastics now to the women's tumbling final and the top performer in qualification candy brière vatillard of france she'll be the second to go Shanice davidson of great britain the second strongest and comfort yates her teammate the third strongest great britain won the team title yesterday france for the defend tumbling final let's get it started Isabel Steinmeier of the United States of America will be first to go. And she turns 22 tomorrow. Team silver medalist as the reserve gymnast yesterday. Based in Batavia in Ohio. Good double layout work. And she does well to hold on to that very slightly under rotated landing that's a very fine beginning for isabel steinmeid vacation might have been trying to get an extra rotation in but didn't have the height for it candy brière vatilla of france 19 year old from the northwest of the country and a team gold medalist last year and then a bronze medalist this year she struggled in the individual final last time around she was the top qualifier and it didn't quite work that certainly was more secure than we saw in the individual final last year where she was sixth Candy we have of a mark and crucially the execution she's lost almost two full marks of execution we talked about some of those form deductions here's Brianna Couchy bronze medalist at the World Games from Australia now this is quite big work from her and that is impressive work fair amount of twisting going on down the track had quite an impact very difficult to stabilize something like that to stay on axis and in line her teammate Coralie Catlett 17 and from the Westmead suburbs of Sydney She really is powerful. My word, is she a powerful gymnast. The distance that she got on that landing match. Shanice Davidson of Great Britain. From Gateshead in the northeast of England. She trains at Durham City Gymnastics Club, where she is also a coach. Gold medalist in the team competition. Yesterday, she's twice been an individual silver medalist. Listen to the roar for Shanice Davidson. Wow. Very big performance from Shanice Davidson. Position with three to go. So Brianna Couchy is confirmed in the final. Here is Manon Morancé of France. Bronze medalist in yesterday's team event. Twice a champion at the World Age Group competitions for younger gymnasts heading to the World Championship. She's a real contender. Isn't she a real contender? That's Manon Morancé of France. The undergraduate in health science and sports studies at Le Mans University dropped into fifth position. Comfort Yates of Great Britain, team champion. In yesterday's competition, she's just 17. One of the youngest in the final from Chichester in West Sussex. Oh, she's done very well to hold that. That's powerful work from Comfort Yates. What a debut world championship she's having. Execution, not huge, but that doesn't matter when your difficulty is that good. To the last gymnast in the first stage of the final, Louise van Regenmortel of Belgium. The 19-year-old is an undergraduate in industrial engineering. She's from Antwerp province in the northeast of the country. If she produces what she did in qualification, she'll get into the final. Oh, she's touched the mat, she's touched the mat. And it looks as though she's all right. <laughs> Brianna Couchy, Coralie Catlett, Shanice Davidson, Comfort Yates, Australia, Australia, Britain, Britain. The four competitors in this women's tumbling final. This is the medal round, just one pass, and it's a zero start. The score from earlier 
is of no consequence. Here's Brianna Couchy, who won a bronze medal at the World Games. And she also, oh no, has come. Wasn't able to complete the final element. It's such a difficult pass. She's got so much in there, that twisting work, and it's just not quite there this time. A oh. full pass. An Australian, however, will win a medal, that is clear. Will it be Coralie Catlett? The only other time it's happened was Alison McHugh winning a bronze medal in 1978 in this event. This is purposeful. And it's successful from Coralie Catlett. That will put her into the lead and it will guarantee her a world championship medal. Double world age group champion, effectively the junior world champion in 2019 in this event and double mini trampoline. And it looks as though she's got herself senior success now. Congratulations to her. To Shanice Davidson of Great Britain. This will be the eighth World Championships in a row when there has been a British competitor on the podium in women's tumbling. She's been there twice before. This is big, this is difficult. And that is stunning! Shanice Davidson has pulled out a sensational pass. The twisting that was going on, was breathtaking. There, and again, and again. Then she really builds up pace and power, twists around in the straight position to land. That is superb and it's going to score well. She's very central to minimal land. Coralie Catlett of Australia is going to win at least a silver medal. And here is Comfort Yates of Great Britain. Comfort Yates as well to conclude this final strong yeah, effort. Has Comfort Yates managed what would be an extraordinary victory? She's got incredible power. There are some evident execution deductions. She's quite far from the central line. But her landing was tidy. Good toe point in the pike position, minimal. And it is sensationally with a score of 24.4. Come for Yates to win Great Britain's third gold medal at these World Championships. And what a close final. Two tenths ahead of Coralie Catlett and just a single tenth ahead of Shanice Davidson. The 17 year old from Chichester. The bronze medal to Shanice Davidson of Great Britain, the silver to Australia's Coralie Catlett, and the title of world champion to Comfort Yates of Great Britain.